Hello, good morning dear students. Narito muli tayo sa ating channel para matuto ng iba't ibang mathematical lessons. So, ang topic natin sa umagang ito is for grade 9. This is in line with K-12 curriculum of the Department of Education. So, ang topic natin is all about determining the values of A, B, and C of quadratic equations. A quadratic equation in one variable is a mathematical sentence of degree 2 that can be written in the following standard form. So, we have AX squared plus BX plus C equals 0, where A, B, and C are real numbers and A is not equal to 0. So, yung A natin dito, hindi pwede maging 0 yan. Yung B dito, pwede maging 0 yan. Yung C natin dito can also be 0, pero yung A hindi pwede maging 0. In the equation AX squared is the quadratic term, BX is the linear term, and C is the constant term. So, para malaman natin if that is quadratic equation, dapat ang highest term niya is on the second degree. Ito, square dapat. So, let us have an example here. So, standard form of equation. Here are examples of quadratic equation in the standard form. So, ang standard form natin is AX squared plus BX plus C equals 0. Here, example number 1. 2X squared plus 6X plus 4. Ano ang A, B, at C dito sa given quadratic equation? So, ang A is the numerical coefficient of x square. Ang B is the numerical coefficient of B. At ang C natin is yung constant, yung walang katabing literal coefficient niya. So, ang A natin is equal to 2. Ito yon. B is equal to 6. And C is equal to 4. So, this is the answer. Let us have another example. Ito naman, x squared minus 2x minus 8 equals 0. What is the value of A, B, and C? So, ang A natin is 1. Automatic yan. Pag walang katabing numerical coefficient, yung term natin, automatic ang numerical coefficient niya is 1. Ang B natin is negative 2 since that is negative 2x. So, negative 2. At ang C natin is negative 8. So, this is the answer. But let us have another example. Example number 3. Negative 4x squared plus 7x plus 2 equals 0. So, ang value ng A natin dito is negative 4. Ang B natin is 7. At ang C is 2. So, this is the answer. Okay, let us have the fourth example. Negative x squared plus x plus 1 equals 0. So, ang value natin, just like what I mentioned a while ago, pag walang numerical coefficient, automatic that is 1. Pero that, since that is negative, syempre negative 1 ang magiging numerical coefficient natin. Our B is also 1. And our C is also 1. Pip example natin. Here is the example number 5. So, 3x squared minus 4x plus 9 equals 0. So, ang numerical coefficient natin dito, 3, negative 4, and 9. So, ang ABC natin is 3, negative 4, at 9. So, that is the answer. So, quiz time naman tayo. Para mat makita ninyo kung talagang natuto kayo. Okay. So, here is our question. Find the A, B, and C of the following quadratic equation in the standard form. AX squared plus BX plus C equals 0. So, 1 to 8 items yan. So, you need to find the value of A and B and C of the following given quadratic equations. So, you may start solving now. So, ito lang na pag natin all about quadratic equation. About finding and determining the value of A, B, and C of a quadratic equation. So, if you want to learn more about quadratic equation, this is for grade 9. Ito ang topic ng grade 9 sa first grading period. So, if you want to learn more, just click the subscribe button at yung notification bell sa baba ng ating video. At tiyak, makakatanggap kayo ng notification sa bawat upload ko sa ating channel. That's all for now. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day.